Hey there, media leaders. I wanna show you a piece of software we use called Asana and how we use it to manage our business. Now we're not the best at this, we're always learning, but this seems to be a really good task management, project management piece of software that's just lightweight enough to not be intimidating and just detailed enough to actually get stuff done. So first of all, you can go to asana.com to learn more about this, A-S-A-N-A. I don't use an email address and password. We log in with our Google Docs. So I'm gonna log in, I believe it's with medialeaders.com and it will log me in. It's kind of nice, that way you don't have to remember a password. I use my company thing. Now, don't get intimidated here. I'm not the best. I'm actually behind on a few things, but I've got my team over here and I'll show you some of this stuff. Up here in the upper left, you have your tasks, you have your inbox, you have your dashboard. If you look at your dashboard, you can see how many tasks are getting done. Symmetry Electronics and and uh, our kids program and all this different stuff. Upgrade to have an unlimited. Now we use the free version, so this dashboard, I actually never use this, but my tasks are the stuff that I'm tagged in that I need to get done. You can drag and drop stuff. You can put them in different buckets. Let's go over to the S3, which is our kids program content thing. Now. We add a bunch of tasks and we always assign them to people. So we've got, uh, let's let's uh, go take a look at one of these. This is Josh to send. So let's take a look at this, Josh to spend time. When you click on one of these over here, it throws it up over here and you've got a big checkbox if it gets done. Josh to spend time laying out the flow of email subscribers so they get lots of content when they sign up for each different part of the newsletter. I've already done this, but what I did is I, I clicked the due date button, which is kind of nice. You can set a due date. You can even set a time if you want, but you set a due date. Uh, let's go ahead and do January, February, March. Let's set it to this Friday, March there. Okay, great. Now. I added some comments here. Clients should be kept out of most of the content when educator signs up, and these are just notes. Another thing you can do is you can click here and you could add a bunch of subtasks. Make sure that emails are from Josh at Media Leaders or whatever, whatever, uh, medialeaders.com or something like, or from no reply, let's say, from no dash reply. And then you can keep going. Who's going to do this? Um, what's the, uh, the, you know, you can ask questions here and these are subtasks under a main task, which can sit under a prod, which can sit under a bullet, or this is a subject heading, which can sit under a project. You can see how detailed this gets. You've also got tags. I can also throw Anastasia's face in here, uh, design it to her. I can put, uh, share your support for this task. Say I'll help with it. You can add attachments. Now there, there's other systems out there like Trello, which is great, but Trello just seems, uh, Trello seems like it has some certain uses, but for a content company like us, this is the best thing that we have. Now, Anastasia has something called buffer Twitter accounts. She sets it every week, and, and so she knows on the 27th she needs to do that. Now, how does this work, Josh? What, why, why are you setting these dates? How do I know how that works? Well, let me show you one other thing, and then I'll show you the calendar. So if I want to do for Josh's speech, if I want to, if I want to add a new one called develop, see here's website updates, let's do hire somebody, right? This is within the content and blogging, uh, send something to an intern. You can go new section. And did you see what happened down here? Instead of it being a task, it's intern responsibilities, if I can spell correctly. And then all I do is I press enter and I've got some tasks, send blog post for new app and I can turn I could throw it over to the right now we know that if we if I tag the intern in there that they'll get that but it's nice to put different stuff here or maybe new content or let's call it fresh content fresh content to um, content to be reviewed or stuff like that so send blog posts for new app and all that junk you know how this works when you're done with something like I, I did here uh, I just click this button right here, this big mark this task complete. Done. Great. Josh completed this task. Okay, let's go take a look at the calendar. Now, each one of these things has a calendar, each one of these projects on the far left. We're using the free version, so you can click more projects, see all of our stuff. If I click calendar, you can see the stuff that we need to get done, right? I got a bunch of stuff due this Friday, a bunch of stuff I didn't get done. I'm, I'm not the best. You can see Anastasia finishes her stuff on time. She does great. 
uh, Josh to reshoot this video. I, I, I've just got some stuff that's not done. The faded stuff is what gets done. You can see Anastasia does this great. I don't. Okay, so it's kind of a nice way to say, let's do this on this date. You can actually click in here and say, you can click once. It takes a little while. Sometimes when you click a second time, there we go. And then you could uh, create new task and it's due on that day. Josh, how do I assign it to myself or somebody? I click assign, comment, comment, or that, the comments. You could also comment, throw links in here. This is another beautiful thing. Let's go to safesmartsocial.com in another, another thing, Con control C. You can throw in, um, use this link to develop or research, whatever. Boom, Hit press enter, comment, look, you can click on this, people can now see it. And then you just click out of it, boom, it's in there. And now if I go to my, my inbox or my tasks, you'll eventually see it up towards the top. And if I go to my calendar, I can see everything assigned to me that I need to get done. I need to do this, 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 and these are from all of my projects. Now you could click on long-term goals, Okay, so you've got the idea. I've shown you the calendar. I've shown you your tasks that just pertain to you. I've shown you the different projects which have to do with everybody and how you can list them and drag them. You can view calendar from within anything. So you can see just for this project how you can throw things on the calendar which end up in the list. You can view the attachments which are kind of cool. We don't do much with the attachments, but as you can see, this is, this is pretty awesome. And we're using, once again, the free version. Here's the team calendar, just with people on this team. If you pay for this, you can see a whole lot more cool features. Now, another thing you can do is personal projects. There's a way to go click Josh, and there's a way to click on my personal projects. If you click up here, I've got media leaders. I've got personal projects here too. And I think I have a bunch of just, I bought a bike air pump. And this way you can work on stuff that not the rest of the company can see. I need to buy some new shoes, pay a check to some people, right? Stuff like that. Pretty easy stuff. We love this and it's just, it's a full screen. Now the beautiful thing about it is that it has an app. Boom, there's my iPhone. Check out this app. We're gonna click on the bottom right, Asana. And you do have to be connected to the web, so you can't do this on you can't do this on a on a flight. But you can click on your projects. You can click on all in the upper right and the Super Bowl party. Well, that's my personal stuff. Let's go click on media leaders. You've got all this different stuff, right? And you can click on the once again media leaders content and blogging. You can go in here and you can see who's assigned it. Um, I am. You know, Anastasia was trying to get stuff done yesterday. You can see what's late and all that good stuff home. It's pretty awesome. Uh, one more feature that we love to do here, and let, let's see, you can search for things as well, which is quite nice. I've never used the search feature, but I do like the projects. I like, you can click the plus button in the bottom right, and you can click for me. You can say new task, new test, task, delete me. I always add that so that I know that it wasn't important. And you can add a description below it and all that stuff. So create, you could add a date and time. Pretty neat, you can access your stuff. Now now we're, we're cooking with, with fire because that, that's pretty awesome. Okay, there's one more, and look, it's up there. Okay, it was on my phone and now it's, it's up there. Now if I create new task, I'm gonna go in here and see if I can look at my home, um, create a new task, I'm gonna click on that, that delete me one, watch this, boom, my phone just vibrated. It'll, it'll uh, remove it. And then we're also gonna go create new task over here and delete that one. And then eventually you'll see those up here, update live. It's really neat how live it is. Uh, you know, it's flying through the interwebs and stuff. You get the idea. Okay, there's one last thing that's pretty awesome. This syncs to my Google calendar. Josh, we don't use Google. Well, it'll Google sync with just about anything, but check this out. This, these orange things are the um, Asana tasks. So buy Josh Oaks a stamp, uh, Josh to drop this in, ask this, boom, 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 right? So now you can see all of my tasks that are due for me uh, in orange. And I don't have many today. Most of them have gotten done and I think they've been removed, but you can see all the different things I was supposed to do on Friday. I probably didn't get them done. Got some of them done yesterday. Okay, so it's kind of neat. Now we're cooking with fire because this is really awesome. It, it syncs with Google. It has a calendar built into it so you can keep track. You can throw things in the calendar, do some content 
planning. I mean, this really is a supercharged project management system that gets content, that works with Google. Some of the world's biggest companies use this. We use the free version and we get by with that. You can add team members. It's pretty awesome. So I encourage you to check this out, asana.com, A-S-A-N-A.com. Hope you guys are great. Talk to you soon. I'm Josh with MediaLeaders.com. Take care. Bye.